Praise the name of the living God. Hallelujah, someone. Uh, welcome to this week's edition of Pray Along. I believe that your life <laughs> keeps on transforming. And we thank God for the many testimonies that we are receiving, for the many calls, for the many supports that we are, we are receiving. One want to appreciate you, but then one will also continue to tell you that keep the support coming. We need the support. Keep them coming. God bless you so much for all the comments, for all the all the many good things that um, is happening during this particular section. This week we are going to have a very important prayer topic like we always have every course of the week. And um, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, don't forget to like it, don't forget to share it for your friends who do not have access to also have access to this particular channel. And most importantly, don't forget to leave your comment. If there is any contribution, if there is any form of prayer request, you can drop it at the, at the, at the comment section so that we pray with you. Hallelujah. Alright, so this week we are taking our scripture. We are praying concerning a, a ministry, okay, service, ministry. You know, we realize that there are people who have the desire, who have the gift, who have the grace for ministry. But you see, one thing that I've come to realize is that they are not able to come out, maybe because of one or two reasons, one or two forces. They are not able to come out to say, they are not able to come out from them to minister, to do the work of the ministry. You see, Brother Paul said that we should do the work of the ministry. And it is something that is very expedient. And something that is very, very important and vital in our days. And so, in the book of Ephesians chapter 4, the Bible said that when Christ ascended, He gave gift unto men. He gave some to be apostles. And He gave some to be prophets. Then He gave some to be, to be pastors and teachers. And some to be evangelists for the work of the ministry and to edify the people and so this was his assignment this was the gift thing that he gave he gave people to be to be to to enter into this fold of ministry and that is what we normally call the five-fold ministry it is to serve it is to serve the church and when you go to the book of romans chapter 12 okay romans chapter 12 i'm reading from verse 6 he said having then gifts different according to the grace that is given to us whether prophecy let us prophesy according to the proportion of the faith or ministry let us wait on our ministry or he that teacheth on teaching or he that exhorted on exhortation he that giveth let him do it with simplicity he that ruleth with diligence and he that showeth mercy with cheerfulness hallelujah and these things are gift things. They are graces that God gives to his people in the church. So you realize that when we get to church, there are people who have the grace to give. There are people who have the ability to give, to serve, to usher. These things are graces. It is all service. It is all part of the ministry. The desire may be there, but sometimes, well, I said, there are forces that pulls us far. The opposition that draws us back from this particular kind of ministry. Oh, but this particular week we are praying, this day we are praying, that that desire that is in us, that grace that God has given unto us, may, may, may those graces manifest in the name of our Lord Jesus. Many a times you can have someone who has the grace to give, now so, or do I sorry them on me, ma, because of one or two things, but they are born by that let these give things begin to manifest in the name of our Lord Jesus. Anyone that has the desire, if you have the desire to be a pastor, if you have the desire to be a prophet, if you have the desire to be an evangelist, if you have the desire to be an apostle, if you have the desire to be a, 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 a prophet, whatever, whatever give things you have the desire for, you are praying that may God cause that thing to manifest in the name of our Lord Jesus. May God cause you to serve in the name of our Lord Jesus. Like we say that ministry is service. You want to pray in the name of our Lord Jesus, the name that is above every other name. Lift up your voice and pray for everybody, for everybody who, who has the desire for ministry one way or the other. Anyone that has this desire for has this will in him or her for ministry, you are praying for that person that let this thing manifest in the name of our Lord Jesus, the Son of the living God. May that grace that is upon their life, may that grace function in the name of our Lord Jesus. You cannot have this grace and just be sitting down. Whenever this grace comes upon you, the grace comes to enable you to function. And so you want to lift up your voice and pray in the name of our Lord Jesus that let this desire 
manifest in the name of Jesus. Lift up your voice and pray that prayer. Lift up your voice. Lala kapala bala kati anta naga ba aranta lala kapala bala matam teli yaka ba roko bolo bolo ko bom teli yaka bala kada ayam teli anta lala kapala kada roko bolo bolo ko tiam telele imatunza bom teli yaka ba ayada lala lava sha bom teli yaka ba roka bala bali am telele ipayan teli yaka ba aranta lika bala bala kada lift up your voice somebody lift up your voice and pray that prayer roka bala bali am telala that they desire the grace ala bala bala that is upon our lives for ministry gabala bala that will be able to function in them madala gabala roka bolo bolo ko bo somebody lift up your voice and pray that prayer me am tena me tu sale raka bala bali am telelele raka bala bali am telekada ason teli yaka bala bala raka bala bali am telekaba raka bali am telekaba the bible said ala bala bala for unto each and every one of us has been given grace according to the measure of the gift of god raka bala bali am telaka bala bala raka bala bali am telaka bala kada raka bala bali am telaka bala yan tena nena may we function in this grace ka bala bala in the name of our lord jesus alan tell you about raka bala bala mati am telalele raka bala bali am telalele puton temeli ya ka bala bala arada la 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 basha bala kada raka bala bali am telaka bala kada raka bala bali am telaka bala kada raka bala bali am telaka bala bala aya ka bala bali am telaka bala kada raka dala ka bala kada la ka bala bala ka dala ka da aram tali ya ka bala bala gran dena ma dala ka ba ara ka bala bali am tele ka ba ra ka bala bali am tele ka ba ayan tele lele ma to sha bala la ra ka bala bali am tele ka da inan da bala bali am tele ka ba azon tele lele let up your voice and pray ka dala bala ka da maybe you are the one watching me maybe you have this desire ara ka bala bala you are praying that maybe desire begin to manifest in the name of jesus ala la bala ba may you function in that grace ala bala bala ara ka bom tali am tele me de yan tene ma lo sha ba ara ka bom tali ya ka bala bala ra ka bala bali am tele ka ba ra ka bala bali am tele ka da ay am tele ka bala bala ra ka bolo bolo ka bom tali ya ka ba ay ka bolo bolo ma ti ya la ka bala bala ka da yam tele ka bom tali ya ka to ta som de ni ma ti ya bam de le ra ka bolo bolo ma ti yan tele ka ba in the name of jesus ala bali am tas i pray for you that may the desire for ministry manifest in the name of jesus you function in that grace in the name of our lord jesus the son of the living god alama tis kapam da luz ulalama tini kapam de ligran tala bala bas raga bala bala madabas the god give you the ability to stand and to say in the name of jesus the son of the living god the good lord be with you the good lord bless you in jesus name amen and amen beloved continue to keep your faith do not give up and i know that your labor in, in the law will never be in vain in jesus name don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like don't forget to share so that your friends can also have access to the channel and above all don't forget to drop your comments and i bless you with the blessing of the law in jesus name amen